Hello, much welcome on my new video. In this video, I will tell you about how we can use the shapes tool and which of the shapes that uh, I have provided in this Adobe Illustrator CC 2019. So, here we are starting. So, firstly, click on the right button of the mouse so you can see the list of these shapes. Uh, the first one is the rectangle tool. This is M is shortcut key for rectangle tool, and second one is rounded rectangle tool. This shapes the edges of this is rounded to inner side of the shape, and third one is ellipse tool. You can also say a circle, circle shape, and the shortcut key of that is L, polygon tool, star tool, and flare tool. We will start from the rectangle tool. I have collected, and now you can see the sign of my arrow is looking something different. So, place on any place of the clipboard and then just drag. You can see the shape is happening. <coughs> you are seeing this the blue line intersect over your side this shows that this is a complete square yeah, square shape this shows that the all edges are equal to each other that's why this line is shown here you can make shape from this easily you can see and just click on left button you have seen the width and height of a shape this is a by default size and you can change size from there like I want to add 200 width and 100 height then this shape becomes you can see this becomes here and the third second one tool is around the rectangle tool you can see the edges of this shape is moved towards the inner side you can see there and you can see uh, the color like black color on the shape this uh, color becomes by default so on hair panel you can see this is a color panel and these are the white and black and white are all the by default colors this one is the fill color you can see uh, the bodies have a black color and there this is shown the black uh, this one is stroke and this one is fill stroke we will say that stroke is a border or a line of uh, any object this this is a border or a stroke of any board body and fill fill is the complete color in the shape this is a fill so this is a short intro and move on another shape ellipse tool ellipse tool you can see there's also the intersect lines are happening in this shape to maintaining that this is a circle perfect circle so if I drag like that like that uh, so I cannot make a perfect shape so for that uh, if I use shift ultra button then I can easily make any perfect circle so the use of shift and uh, shift button uh, we can make any shape anything or any way in a straight line a straight way okay so as we have did with rectangle tool we have tape on there you can see here also this happening width and height uh, panel opening and you can make any changes in the sizes of that okay so polygon tool this is a uh, an interesting tool if you make 
this like this you can make uh, it takes some by default edges and if you want to create uh, uh, what you want or uh, how many edges have in this shape you have need to just tap there left uh, left click on the mouse and, make, and now you can see this is the radius and this is the slides means edges this edges on a shape if I say I want to make a triangle triangle has three edges so I just clicked and you have see this triangle was made it here if I want to make uh, 20 slides of a shape and now you can see the circle here why this happening because with the help of this polygon tool we can not make too much edges in a body and the circle has does not have any edge you can see so a star tool with the help of the star tool we can make stars same as this is the radius 1 and radius 2 and points 5 points like edges if I add 6 points now you can see uh, the difference between that shape and that shape you can easily see this shape have 5 points and this shape have 6 points and uh, last one is flare tool see this is also an interesting tool flare tool but <laughs> it is not easy to use that uh, firstly if you are a beginner you have need to take some uh, means some hard work or some practice on that tool then you can easily make this so this is a short intro on shapes tool and uh, I you will like this video and I will again come on the next video with a next element of the Adobe Illustrator okay thank you